Hi ladies! So today I'm going to be filming a vlog video and this is the first one I've ever done so hopefully it's not too boring for you. Um, I decided to vlog because I've been having a lot of trouble trying to get the um, setup, the film setup, using my new camera right. So for those of you who don't know, I mentioned it in my last two videos, I actually got a new camera and it's the Canon HD Vixia camcorder and I will um, write all the details below the actual model number so if you have the same camera or you're wondering about it you can ask me um, and I really really like the camera the quality of the footage is really great and the photos that it takes like still images are really really strong so I'm really happy with it but trying to find a new setup is getting kind of exhausting and trying to figure out lighting and all of that and I don't know, with my MacBook it wasn't as difficult trying to figure out that kind of stuff. I just kind of plop my MacBook down near a window and let the natural light face me and that was the end of it. But this camera seems to be a little bit more picky with light, which kind of makes sense because it is a higher quality camera. It would be a little bit more finicky. Um, but with that comes a lot of stress trying to figure out what kind of lighting I can use and how you're going to be able to see me properly. So I've been probably filming two to three videos each and every day and you're wondering, well where are they? They're sitting stacked on my computer just waiting to be edited or waiting to be uploaded but each time I watch them back I just can't stomach showing them to you. I just don't think they're a quality that um, I would be proud putting up on my channel. So I've been really playing with it and I think cross my fingers because I said this twice already yesterday, I think I finally figured it out. I actually am using now one, two, three, four lights in front of me, plus I've got a window over here that's bringing a bit of natural light and a bit of natural light from the window over there. Um, and the big huge light that I'm using is actually a 500 watt construction light um, and that's kind of shedding a lot more light on me. So. I'm hoping that this is going to work and this is the last time I'll have to upload this vlog or film this vlog and I can upload it tonight and get it to you and start seriously filming. And one of the reasons why I've been trying like a mad woman to figure this all out is because I'm actually going to London, England a week Friday which I'm so excited about and it's going to be amazing and I'm actually going for a conference, a psychology conference and I'm going to be speaking at the conference. So the conference is four days long but I'm there for seven days so I've got three days where I can explore London and England and enjoy my time. And for the four days, I not only get to enjoy the conference, but there's also free time there where I can explore London as well. So I'm definitely excited. My mom and my nana are coming with me. So it's like the three generation of women in my family all going. And I'm just couldn't be more excited. But because I'm going away, I need to pre-film some videos for you so you don't get huge gaps like you've been getting and I felt so bad about it and if I have my setup right I'm not going to let those gaps go again. Before I get to my next thing I'm going to be doing an about me video and I actually filmed this video again. I filmed an about me video using a 24 question tag um, three times and I was trying to like condense it and condense it because I can only film 10 minute videos and to answer the 24 questions was taking at least 16, 17 minutes. So, um, I, but then I would like watch it back and I just was bored. Maybe I'm just bored by myself. Maybe I'm not a very interesting person, but I just found the questions were so boring. Like who cares what my favorite fast food restaurant is? So I decided to kind of open it up to you. If you have any questions about me, about my life, about where I come from, um, about fashion, beauty, style, and again, it could be my personal life or my fashion-y life or my schooling or anything at all, just comment them in the bar below and I'll pick out um, appropriate and um, interesting questions and questions that come up a lot and make a whole separate video once I get enough of those questions. So write them in this um, comment or inbox message them to me or you can also write them on my channel comments thing so you can get the questions to me there. And I guess the only last thing I have to talk about is my blog. So. When I was thinking about doing this vlog video, I was going to ask you guys whether you thought it would be a good idea if I had an accompanying blog with this YouTube channel. And 
when I see gurus that do that, I'm kind of like, I kind of question why. Like, why do they need a blog and a YouTube channel? Why not just put more videos up on your YouTube channel? Like, that's your priority. Why not do that and then, you know, get rid of the blog? Like, why are you spending so much time? And it would always be the same thing. Like, you'd go on the blog and they would just have embedded YouTube videos. So what's the point in having both? Anyway, so I wasn't sure if I was going to do it. And when I decided to do YouTube, I kind of decided I was going to abandon the idea of doing a blog. But I realized that there are little things that I am not going to include on my YouTube channel, like a recipe or like pictures of, you know, me and my family or pictures of my boyfriend and I or pictures of my cats or whatever it is or just my like thoughts and um, I'm not going to put those things on YouTube so I really wanted a place to do that and it was between doing a vlog channel or, or doing a blog and I just love to write and think it would be a lot easier to update a blog than to do um, double the editing of videos and filming of videos and uploading of videos. So my blog is, and I will put it right here, um, victoriascloset16.wordpress.com. I have one blog post on there because I did it yesterday. Um, oh, and as I was saying, I kind of got off track, but I was going to ask you if you wanted to see a blog, but then I got so excited thinking about the things I would do with it that I just had to do it for myself. So I did the blog and I designed it all day yesterday and now it's up and running. So um, it was kind of a fast decision and just I stayed up all night one night and woke up really early the next morning and designed it and did everything for it. So now it's up and it's nothing fancy but um, that's what it is. It's the Victoria's Closet 16.wordpress.com and if you click somewhere along here um, I'm going to try to get it so that it brings you right to the website and it'll also be linked in the bottom bar below so go check that out. I think that's it. If you've ever been to London, England and you have any suggestions on where to eat, where to go and what sites to see or where to shop because girl knows I'm going to be shopping, um, please let me know. Comment in the bottom bar. I would love your feedback. I'm trying to plan out the whole trip now kind of more down to what we're doing each and every day because I'm not around for a few of the days so I need to really plan out my time well so let me know when I can include those in my plans and pictures of England will definitely go up on my blog and I'll probably do be doing a, a haul and maybe just kind of like a follow me around thing on this channel as well from that trip so that's it I am gonna go and wrap this video up because I think it's getting a little long but I miss you and I miss putting up videos and don't think that I'm gone I'm just really trying to figure out the hell that is getting this film set up right and um, I'm definitely still here and still doing videos and I am very excited to see you in the next one bye